our next horse that we're going to review is uh, also manufactured by International Game Co. And it's called the Classic Horse. If you take a look here, this is the $500 one. There's different variations of this one as well. You have the 250 one. I believe there's a, either a 100 or 150 one, but I'm not really sure. I've never played that one, but I've played the 250, I've played the 500, and I've played the 599. It may be something more than that too, but I'm not really sure about that one because I haven't played it. This is actually a pretty fun horse because this is a smaller box. Uh, this horse t technically has, I think it's 740 tickets. Let me make sure. 740 tickets in here, so it's easier to get a horse. Uh, you also always want to look at uh, the number of tickets in a horse because normally the bigger the number of tickets, the bigger the payout is on a horse. But these are pretty easy to get. Um, I usually get multiples of these. Um, International Game Co. horses always look pretty much alike. And... They always list their horses with the numbers. If you can look here, you'll see the numbers. This is horse 12. So horse 12 is going to be B12, I27, N42, G57, and O72. Um, what is this one? This is 9, and this is 13. So it's a fun game. Try to get multiples if you can because, again, it's a smaller box. So this is one that I wouldn't mind buying a 50 stack on because there's chances that you can get, you know, two or three horses in one stack. It just really depends on uh, your luck and how it goes. Again, this is a fun game. The 599 one is a little better because you get that extra hundred bucks on there, which is cool. Uh, if you're a professional, you'll know International Game Co's horses because they all have the same colors. So we all know horse one is the light blue. We know uh, 12 is the red. Seven is red also. Uh, what is it? Three and eight are green. 11 and 14 are like a grayish white. Nine is purple and so on. I think 13 is purple. Yeah, 13 is purple as well. So again, it's a fun game. Classic horse. Um, if you have any questions, drop them in the comments and we're going to review our next horse.